We are out and about up in a big city today and we were recently gifted a Sam's Club membership. So I have come into Sam's Club to grab dinner for our family tonight because I need to do another large family grocery shop shopping trip here in the near future. Also, today's video is sponsored by the National Pork Board. Okay, here are all kinds of pork loins and look, it even says that at Sam's, it'll be their pleasure to custom slice your boneless pork loin for free. Super nice. Let me have a look at these. This is always such a frugal meat. $1.79 a pound. This one is seven pounds, 6.25 ounces. Only $13 for all of that. Pork is quick and easy to cook when done properly. This whole boneless pork loin is a versatile cut that can be prepared in a multiple ways, so don't be afraid of it. It's only $11.81 for almost seven pounds. Ooh, now we're gonna look at cheeses. We always need these at the house. You know my kids love colored peppers. And this is just a total kid treat for the weekend. Friends of ours have this swing and it has been our hopes and dreams to get one. It's like a spider web swing and look, it's regularly, it was $49, it's $20 off. It's only $29.71. We are back home. I'm getting ready to get this whole boneless pork loin cooking for our big family dinner this evening. Getting one of these large whole boneless pork loins is a great way to meal plan because there's so many different things you can do with this meat and it's also perfect as we know for feeding a large group. I'm also going to do this bag. These look cute and even though I'm not having potatoes right now, the kids will love it. Just these little potatoes. They look like fun. We're going to do our broccoli and a big salad too. So the first thing I'm going to do is cut into this pork loin. We are going to coat it with olive oil and salt and pepper. I also am having the trouble. I can't find half the things I need today. I'm sure you have days like that. I have this brush to brush on ingredients. Can't find it now. So we are just going to drizzle. That's about four tablespoons of olive oil. I'll flip it over here in a minute. So here we are all coated with the olive oil and salt and pepper. So I flipped it fat side up. Of course, I don't have a pan long enough for this. So I've just put it in a U shape. We're gonna get it in the oven now. I am going to roast this pork loin at 425 for about 20 minutes. And then without opening my oven door, I'm gonna reduce the heat down to 350 and then I'm gonna cook it for 15 minutes per pound until we reach an internal temperature of 145 degrees. And so while that's in the oven, I have some other work I'm going to do. We will come back at the very end. I will get these potatoes in the Instant Pot. I'll show you how I do those. And we'll steam the broccoli, chop salad, and those kind of things. Okay, I just turned the temperature down to 350, and now I'm going to set the timer for an hour and a half. And then I'll take the internal temperature and see if we're gonna need a little longer or not. But my uh, J. Morrell intuition says this should get us pretty close. So here is the pork loin. We have had pork loin success and even confession. I couldn't stand it. I have sliced a piece and I am eating it because mama is hungry and needs some protein. Boneless pork loin is safe and most delicious when cooked to an internal temperature of 145 degrees Fahrenheit followed by a three minute rest. While our pork is resting, I'm gonna go ahead and get these potatoes here in the Instant Pot going. So here's how our dinner is working out. I've taken half the pork loin, I've cut it. I poured back over some of the yummy juices that are made from it. My kids are filthy outside doing go-karts, playing in puddles, having a good old time. No way do I wanna clean them up right now. So I'm gonna feed them outside on the deck until they're officially done with the day. This is one of the plates. So you can see we have the tenderloin pork roast and the broccoli and these delicious little small potatoes. I'm setting out a plate for another kiddo. Gotta get drinks and call them in from the wilderness. But I have one kiddo inside now washing their hands. So I'm gonna go make another plate. It is a misconception that pork has to be cooked until the juices run clear and the meat is white. With modern pork production practices, commercial retail pork is safe when it is cooked to an internal temperature of 145 degrees, which will be a warm blush pink color. These standards are determined by the USDA and FDA food code. The most delicious pork is not overcooked. 
Thank you again to the National Pork Board for sponsoring this video. Buy whole boneless porks from Sam's Club and cook it to the proper temperature. So just buy pork and cook it properly.